Who would win in a battle to the death? A human brain in a robotic suit, or an ape processor in a human body? Well, Prance, I think this one's right up your alley. Who do you think would prevail in a battle to the death? A human brain in a robotic suit or an AI processor in a human body? It's simple Sweden. We don't even have to debate it. Let me tell you, I heard this story from a friend of mine who knows a guy that was there, but let me tell it anyway. There was a gang of street thugs who went up against a robotic humanoid, and guess what? The street gang won. No, a processor is going to be tougher That's than that. That's not what we're talking about here. That's a different scenario. Now that I think about it, though, I do have a friend who knows somebody who once faced a robot in a battle to the death. Please, Sweeben, don't be silly. I'm serious. She said the robot was massive and had tools and weapons coming out of it. And in the end, the robot was no match for her friend's will to survive, and they managed to take it down. I'm going to go with the eye processor. I mean, if you're going up against a robotic humanoid or an AI processor, it has to be a lot smarter and more powerful, sure. right? But if you talk about two machines in a battle to death, the constant variables are size, strength, and power. So, if they're both evenly matched, then my friend's story proves that the human will to survive might just be the deciding factor. I don't think so. Look, if it's a battle to the death, then the robot is going to have some kind of backup energy source that gives it the edge over a human body. You're assuming that all robots are coming equipped with these backup energy sources. It's an iffy assumption. Even if they don't, they still have superior speed, agility, and accuracy. Wow, there's no way we can agree on this one. Well, we can agree to disagree and move on for now. Okay, I guess that then. What?